okay spa that's what i have to do in the morning i just feel the music relax my mind to start my day oh my god did i get my hair wet anyways i'm getting my hair <laughs> i'm getting my hair done in a few days so don't judge me actually judge me i always say that i always say latoya stop pointing out your flaws and apologizing for it. This is me. This is what it is. Like, this is reality, and this is my hair today. My face. Say hi to the baby. Yo, my ADHD is on 10. I know that you guys think that, well, I know that you guys know that I have, you know, some loose screws maybe, <laughs> but, and that I joke a lot, but I actually have ADHD and we can talk more about it in another video because I just think that if I get into that topic it's going to be like a three hour video because it's just a lot especially when you have ADHD trying to explain it you know so anyways right now I'm just in the kitchen I want to make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich so bad. Like, I've been loving peanut butter and jelly. I think it's, you know, obviously it's the baby because before the baby, I was not feeling a peanut butter and jelly. I didn't ever wake up and be like, oh yeah, I want a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Like, now I'm eating peanut butter and jelly sandwiches with cornstarch on the side for a dessert. Anyway, some stuff came in for the baby. Thank you guys so much for purchasing some cute little items for my baby boy oh my gosh you guys are spoiling the baby so if you guys want to get the baby something cute i will link my baby registry in the description box below oh my gosh look at how cute this khaki onesie is i'm so obsessed thank you so much to all of my hunties my uncles that have been purchasing baby stuff from my Amazon and Target baby registry. You guys are so kind and I just truly love you and thank you for your support and thank you for embracing this new chapter, this new journey. It's a new journey! The toys are always going on a new journey every single year. It's so new, girl. Shoo, but I'll tell you this much. After I give birth to this baby, okay? We are not having any more babies. I say that after every kid. Anyways, oh my gosh. First of all, you guys never leave your name. That's number one, okay? Number two, start leaving your name. You guys, so what do you think about this? I want to do a live baby shower because you guys have just been purchasing things for this baby. But the only thing is you guys haven't been leaving your name. Like, how do I know who it's from? There's never a name. So start leaving your name in the notes so I can give you a shout out. What do you guys think? Should we do a live baby shower? Comment below and I will open up all the baby stuff on live. So I actually want to save this stuff depending on what you guys say because I think that would be super cute. And showcase, oh the cute, like look at this onesie. Oh my gosh, with like a little black hat and a gold chain with like a money, like a, you know, money symbol. Like yo, yo, yo. A little puffer vest. Yeah, a little puffer vest, you know what I'm saying? With some Yeezys on, you know what I'm saying? Swag. Like this stuff is essential. Like diapers, onesies, wipes, you know, you can never have enough. And then after we can donate it. That's what I do with all my stuff. I just give it away to one of my followers or you know, somebody that reaches out and needs it. I give it away. Let me know in the comments below if I should have a live baby shower showcasing all of my baby stuff that you guys have been purchasing you guys have been so generous and i love and appreciate all of you and it's a great way for me to you know share this with you guys and just say thank you you know i love you guys i want a peanut butter and jelly sandwich oh my gosh i haven't been eating peanut butter and jelly at all okay that was sarcastic like i've been drinking it okay like i don't know obviously i know what it is it's pregnancy because i am not like a like, I don't have a sweet tooth. I like chocolate, but like, I've been eating Sour Patch Kids and just like lollipops and a lot of candy. And Slick was like, how his kids, they love sweets. Like, love sweets. Well, so it's in his genes, I guess. They love sweets. He loves cakes and stuff. I never used to eat cake, and I'm like fiending for, you know, red velvet cake and all this kind of cake. And I wonder what. 
Do people put jelly on cake? I don't know, that sounds pretty good. What is your snack or like how often do you eat when you're carrying somebody? How often do I eat when I'm carrying somebody? A baby. I, <laughs> I don't know the language. <laughs> it depends. Like some days I can go hours without eating because I feel nauseous. And then when I do eat, it's something unhealthy. I know it's not good for you. And that's why you take your vitamins every single day. These are my vitamins. I take the Ritual Essential for Women um, prenatal multivitamins so the baby is getting the nutrients it needs to continue to grow. Now, do I want my baby to continue to grow? I don't know because it's very big right now. Like, I feel this baby kicking way too often. I'm just like, bro, he has no space in there. I think this baby is going to be the biggest out of all my kids, like when they were first born. And Slick, he his babies were all over eight pounds. <gasps> my kids were like six, maybe seven-ish. Not no damn eight. Uh, I'm gonna tell my doctor, like, doctor, can you give me like, no, I don't want a C-section, I'm scared of C-sections. You want him to sew you back. I've been sewed. I've been stitched back with Samia. Oh my God. How big it, was she? Six pounds, five ounces, I think. Mm. Not big. I just be making it up. I actually forget how big all my kids were. I'm actually scared to have this baby. I mean, you do have about two and a half, two months left, so you got room for it to get large. Exactly, because at the end, like around this time, it just like blows up and it drops and it's so uncomfortable and this whole pregnancy has been uncomfortable, you know? So I'm just kind of like, as time goes on, I get scared. Like, mm -hmm. and then last night I didn't even sleep. Well, you don't need to panic because that's stress. Well, I mean, I'm used to stress. Yeah, you're adding more stress. <laughs> Your body's already stressed on the inside. <laughs> well, this baby's like living in a kingdom, chilling. On a regular day, okay, so in the morning, I'll do like an egg sandwich, eggs and avocado, you know, like bacon sometimes. I might do some cereal, I might do oatmeal, depending on how I feel. Sometimes like a little protein shake, you know, smoothie. It just depends. But you're gonna eat. Well, it is. Yeah. And for lunch, I like bowls. I like chicken bowls, shrimp bowls, veggie bowls. And then for like dinner, I'll do like chicken or salmon with like vegetables, like so basic. And then every so often, I'll do curry chicken, stew chicken, lentil soup, leftover food like spaghettis, pastas, all that. So you're not like, cause some people crave food. You eat cause your body needs it. I uh, eat. You can tell. I mean, the way you just ate that sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> That's so good. So Liv hates the smell of peanut butter and jelly. <gasps> That's home. I know, right? Like, who hates the smell? He's like, he can smell peanut butter separately and like, you know, jelly on its own, but when it's combined, he can't take it. All right, guys, so after the sandwich, I'm getting dressed because I wanna go to the mall. I usually do online shopping, but I just feel like getting out the house today. Like, I just wanna be outside today. I've been in a little bit of a funk and I just need some, you know, fresh air, new scenery. So we're going to the mall. I need to get some like holiday outfits. The baby's still growing. I need clothes. I can't wear the robe all freaking day. I mean, I can, but I don't want to. Like I want to get dressed and feel pretty and feel cute, you know? So I'm going to go to the mall and grab some outfits for my baby bump. After I wear it, should I return it all back to the store? No. I mean, I'm not going to need it. Someone will be in need. Oh yeah, sure. But so I want my money back. <laughs> Usually after I wear stuff, you guys, I put it on my Poshmark. People buy that stuff up all the time because they know what's new. No, I'm just joking. I'm going to donate my stuff. I donate all the time anyways. It's going on. The jelly's gone. Mm -hmm. Give it up. No, no. What, do you have syrup? Make a syrup sandwich. Ooh. Should we try? Never mind. I should not have got yeah, it. Wait, wait, wait. It's one second. Let's try it real quick. Mmm. 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 Mm hmm. Now Slick gonna be real upset. 
Why? The smell of syrup is worse than jelly. Is it? I love syrup. Mmm. You don't remember them syrup sandwiches? Bomb. That's a thing? What? You just put syrup in Hunties, is that a thing? Mmm. Everybody had to do syrup sandwiches when you ran out of jelly. <laughs> That's bomb. I'm gonna start eating. Hold on. Just wait. No! What do you mean, not? Now you're gonna be hooked on syrup mm -hmm. sandwiches. I don't know why you told me that. <laughs> I honestly don't know why, because I ran out it's of It's a whole other experience. Mom experience. I love this. Thank you so much. The way that the, the when the bread hits the syrup and it just kind of melts. Oh my god. Okay, so you you eat syrup sandwiches at night. No, kids, you had to eat that if you wanted sweets because my mom didn't have sweets in the house. So you can make you a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Is that too much? To get you something sweet. That is way too much. Mm. This is not a pancake. Mm. Or yeah, French okay. toast. Mm-hmm. Eating it like it's a taco. Mm -hmm. mm. You didn't okay. put peanut butter yeah, on it. Peanut butter on it's bomb too. It's greedy when you just do syrup. She that means you it. ran out of peanut butter. Right. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm pregnant. Leave me alone. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's bomb. That's good. I have to get dressed. We have to go. Shanae will be here any minute now. I'm tired. Pregnancy is not fun. Like, I'm just like mixed emotions. You just sat there and ate the 50 million sandwiches. Two. You're lucky that I don't have any more jelly left. Can y'all send me some jelly? Mm, 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 mm. What? What are you laughing at? I'm just really so confused right now. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm so freaking childish, you know? <laughs> Greedy. Oh my god! <laughs> Anyways, y'all, finish on the way. Um, I need to do my makeup, okay? I love y'all. Bye. Good morning, no, good afternoon, hunties. It's your girl, Latoya. I'm covering up my pigmentation. My daughter's calling me. I have dark marks right here because I have a beard and I pick the ingrown hairs and then it leaves scars. Um, no, she's out of school. Is she out of school? It's 2.11, it's, it's early. Hang on. Doll, you are you, are you okay? okay? Yeah. Where are you? Oh, you didn't have school today. Wait, you thought it was not okay? No, I thought you were calling me from school and I was like, oh my gosh, what's wrong with me, Data? Say hi, Samia. Hi. Oh wait, let me see your outfit. Like, I wish I had style when I was your age like this. Like, I swear I would get dressed with my eyes closed when I was nine. Like, I didn't even think about what I had on. Did you guys? Yeah. Yes, mommy? Oh, mom. Hi. Hi, babe. I missed you so much. I miss you too. When do I see you? When? Yeah. On Thursday. So, yeah. How do you feel living in two homes? Bad. Why? I do not want to learn to moms. I know. It's mm. annoying. It's annoying going back and forth, right? Uh -huh. Does it make you feel like a little unstable? What do you mean? Like, just like not settled. Exactly, yep. Um, so how about all of you guys move over here? <laughs> <laughs> That would be fun, one big blended happy family. Drama. I know. Do you think it would be better if mommy moved closer to your dad's house? Yes. Uh, like, move in this neighborhood, mom. You think so? Yes. They made so many different houses. Like, that's not living in the front. They made so much houses, mom. I know. I love that neighborhood. I actually miss that neighborhood, to be honest. And I, I want you to come so I can walk to your house. I know, but I just think that that's something that we as adults will have to discuss. And besides, when you have to drive me, I can just walk there. Right. From school. Mm-hmm. 
Anyways, we'll talk about all that stuff later. Anyways, so, what do you got to do? I'm getting dressed. I'm going to the mall. Mommy? Yeah? Can you buy something? I knew you were going to say that. What do you think you need? Can you buy me, like, you know how, like, an oil for scented skin, like, an oil to make your face, like, dehydrated and, like, good? And then, like, make your face, like, more moisturizing? Simia, you know? I just think that right now you have your CeraVe products that you use and it works well with your skin because you have sensitive skin. All that other stuff that you were using, those products are for adults. You already have beautiful skin and your skin is sensitive so you can't use anything on your skin. You're, you broke out from a rash from using all those products. Can you buy me some heels? Do you ask your father to buy you these things? Yeah. You're not getting heels. I just feel like, why do you want to be grown so bad? Okay, can you buy me a pretty dress? Then? So yeah, we can buy you a dress. Can you go to Zara and buy me like a cute outfit, like a dress? This outfit that you have on is so cute. If they have any dresses, just call me, okay? Okay, I'll give you a call. And you know my style, so you better get it right. Girl, please. Christmas is around the corner, so I'll think about the stuff on your Christmas wish list. You already know my Christmas wish list. I mean, I read it. You have it in your room. I'm not done with it, girl. Who are, you girl? <laughs> Who are you calling girl? Who are you calling girl? I said girly puppy mommy. Yeah, no. I'm not one of your friends, eh? I'm your mother. Only buy me a little bit of stuff because Uncle Jackie and... And Uncle Warren and Miles and Andy Julie can buy me those things. Too. Okay, so I won't buy you anything, okay? Okay, mommy, I have to go. I have to go to the mall, okay? Mommy, hold up, hold up. You're not gonna betray me like that. What did you say? I said I'm not buying you anything. Why? Uh, because. Because what? Because first off, you have a gift card, don't you? Or like um a credit card? Mom, please. You better let me use that in a Christmas shop on that card, honey. Uh, okay, Where's that credit card at? <laughs> Good thing I bought it with me. Where that credit card at? <laughs> Good thing I bought it with me. Yo, my mom used to use up my money too. <laughs> and mommy. Yeah. And mommy. Mm -hmm. are, are you using my my bank account when I get money for YouTube and also my college bank account? Absolutely. I'm gonna use that at the Christmas shop. Mommy, stop. <laughs> I'ma use your college fund money. If parents do that, that means that means they're they're selfish and they're wealthy and they think that they're so rich, but they're just rich because you have your dollar side. So don't use my things. She's rich. And you and they and they're broke. So they you're ri you're rich. Yes, I'm richer than you. Okay, yeah, you are. You are. And mommy, can you tell all of your fans to subscribe to mine? Cause I need a million. You know, you need to be consistent on your channel. No, I don't care for that. I need a million. Goodbye. You're acting weird. I don't like this energy that you're giving. <laughs> I want you to, like, act like a nine-year-old. Remove those dangling earrings. Take off that necklace. Okay? Go put on a Disney princess shirt and get off my line. Heck no. Heck no. You just said you like my outfit, so don't be talking. Is she about to start her period? What? I hope you start your period at school. No. Bye. I hope I do. All right, we'll talk about um your YouTube channel more <clears throat> when you come. I, I Jamie is supposed to be for, helping you. I want to. I want to be a model for ba kids brands. You want to model for kids brands? Are you sure you want to do that? Yeah. We'll talk, Samia. You have a it's, lot of dreams and aspirations, and I want to support you. And you want you. me to be a, a, an actor, right? <clears throat> but there's a lot of things that we need to sit down and discuss. So didn't, when you didn't you say didn't you say that a lot of people are asking me to a act for them? Yeah, but the thing is, Samia, I just want you to be a kid for right now. So just enjoy being a kid. No. <laughs> this social media has really been shifting you children into thinking that you want to do all of these 
adult things and work. Just be a it's kid, not. do like, your schoolwork, play with your friends, have, have sleepovers. Friends. Well, no, not sleepovers, but like play with your friends, go Why ride your bike. Over. Okay, gotta go. Bye. Bye. Love you. Love you, I guess. I was just kidding. I love you. I so much. Okay, that's why you're not getting anything for Christmas. You're on the naughty list. Goodbye. Hung up on her. Oh my gosh. She turned nine years old and this is what I get? What? Mom, it was just a joke. I don't joke around with respect. So have a good day. I love you, Mom. Are you actually getting me things for Christmas? I don't know. I really don't. And she's not gonna. She's gonna stay at her father's house for the rest of the year, if she's gonna be acting like that. Or else she'll have her period over there. Yeah, I think the period is coming because she's growing. I just think that my kids act different because of their situation now you know okay guys so i'm going to the mall because we are going shopping oh shopping you know thanksgiving is around the corner the holidays christmas new year's so we are about to go shopping for this growing baby bump oh gosh we've been doing a lot of shopping lately and i just feel like whenever i try to wear an outfit it's like too tight. So I have to like buy things that accommodate the bump. So stretchy things, body con stuff, jeans. I don't know, I just wanna get some cute outfits. Shanae usually puts my outfits together so she'll be coming with us. And um, I will just be judging every outfit and look that she puts together to make it, to put my little touch on it. Anyways guys, um, I'm kinda, out of it because I'm under the weather you know lack of sleep I've been tired I've just been mentally drained I just feel like my brain is doing so much I just have so much on my mind from pregnancy to like the kids um, I just spoke to their dad about a few things you know I just have a lot. I, I, I was just crying. She's like, been very emotional. I've been so emotional. Yeah. Shanae, was I crying like 20, 30 minutes like ago? She'll cry and then she'll stop and then everything will be fine and then she'll be like, what's going on here? Okay, Shanae, how was I before pregnancy? Shanae, get on camera. I just feel like I'm so. I need to Hi, get some. Hi, It's your girl, Shanae, back again with another video. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I feel like you're the same, but just like a notch up, you know? <laughs> right. So. so from your perspective, hunties, when you're watching, does it feel like I'm all over the place and I have ADHD? Or do you just think that I'm a ball of like energy or do you think that I'm emotional? I just love to see their point of view. Because right now, I just feel like all over the place. I think they just see you as just the big personality. Yeah. I think that's what you guys see. But what we see behind the scenes is a different story. Jamie, what do you see behind the scenes? <laughs> I see that it doesn't take this long to get to the store. Yeah. <laughs> oh, let's go. So in other words, we have to go. Do you need Sinead to help I you? I think I'm, I'm stuck. I can't get up. I'm fine. Just put one arm in. <laughs> oh, God, this baby. No, but I'm glad you haven't been, like, cussing me out and stuff. Should I don't say huh? that on camera. Let me... No, Do I really cuss you out? No, but I did. Why? Oh, the other girl was poor. When oh. she was pregnant? Yeah, girl. And then apologize like afterwards, you know, after birth. Oh, that made it okay. She's like, I'm just, I was a different person then. Yeah, you know I what? I understand no hard feelings. I think that women who are pregnant, we get passes. Because we're pregnant, we're hormonal, we're carrying, we're, we're creating human life. So it's, it's different. Are you ready? Another Amazon package. Yep. From Latoya. Mm -hmm. 
just randomly buy the things. Okay, this is heavy. You know what? It just Baby, can you help me? It's, it makes me happy. What? What? <laughs> <laughs> do we have to go to perimeter mall like i'm tired of that mall there aren't any other malls in atlanta but lennox i mean they don't have all the shops do they perimeter has all the female shops they do but i'm just tired of that mall it's choking me like i don't want to wear this belt it's choking me like i don't even want to be outside right now I, I need to get out the house but i don't want to be out the house i don't like my hair I feel like I don't like my outfit right now. Like, I'm just going to be negative Nancy today, so. So what happened when you went to the Black Digital? Did you feel this way? I had a fabulous time, and everyone loved my dress, and I presented an award. The lady that um, I presented the award to, she wasn't there. And I was like, can I just take the award for myself? But no, they didn't give it to me. <laughs> like, why not? I'm pregnant. I'm the best dressed pregnant lady up in here like pregnant ladies always do you know what i'm saying like the dress and this baby bump should have won an award but it's it's all good i am the freaking award show how about that oh my gosh honestly i'm not ungrateful at all like i'm just happy that you know i was invited and on top of it i got to present an award you know and so i'm happy but i'm just saying i should have gotten the ladies award that didn't show up how are you today are you having a good day oh, yeah. oh, good yeah. terrible but it'll get better in jesus name y'all yeah. so when i went into the restroom first of all i just need women to like get their hygiene together not all women but women who use public bathrooms like understand that other women are using toilet after you so i went through three stalls to get to uh, a decent stall the first stall okay had a bunch of toilet paper in the toilet the second stall had a balled up uh toilet paper with blood on it just on a period why the hell didn't you just put it in the damn toilet okay and the third one just had pee in it okay Hey, hey, hey. Okay, that just made me happy. Forget about these women that go to the restroom. Just flush the damn toilet and wipe the seat off. That's it. How are you, ladies? Great. How are you? Good. good. Yeah, Express I just lied to her and I said that I'm doing good. I should have said I was doing terrible. Let's go to Express. I love Express. And you know what? I'm just going to start telling people the truth. How are you, Latoya? I'm terrible today. How are you? Are you going to fix my day for me? All right, I'm going to fix up my attitude. Oh, look, y'all. It's buy one, get one, 50% off. Cute little comfy, you know? Loungewear, like sets. That is so cute. Shanae, can you put my phone in your bag, please? All right, Shanae's going to do her thing. So when Shanae and I shop together, I just show her things that I like. And she'll, like, try to figure out how to put it together. Oh, these are cute. These are cute. I've been into like rhinestones and like diamonds for the holidays. These are cute, but I have so many of them already. Am I wearing this in the mall right now? I don't feel like that's cute. I, have the black boots. I like that. What size is that? Medium and small. It Let varies with you. Let's see. So this is medium. I think we should do the small. <laughs> okay, this one's the. Let me tell the medium. Yeah. Because looks are deceiving. This is medium, right? Oh. No, then we need small. Yeah, express yeah. fits yeah, big. I think of, it's wide. Yeah. So we'll get the small. I'm not going to try it on. Can we get some food? Food. I'm hungry. Yeah, I'm not getting pregnant again. It's my last time. I feel like I'm just missing out on life throughout my 30s. Well, you had three years. <laughs> and you know what? I had three years but the thing is we went through a whole pandemic for a whole year i feel like i'm outside when i'm pregnant it shouldn't be that way so after the baby i am going to be the most fashionable the most social and well traveled so move over jamie i am your partner in crime <laughs> the baby will come we'll have a nanny right 
we can go out two hours go back to the hotel breastfeed or you know pump and give it to the nanny there's ways baby will be with us and it's free <laughs> We don't have to pay for a ticket for the baby. <laughs> Although it's like a dream to like explore the world, I haven't made an effort to. Because whenever I think of vacation, I always just go to the Caribbean. I like this. That's, and have you seen some like that's bomb. sheer leggings? That's bomb. That's bomb. But I'm just trying to figure but out. I love this. You love this? Yeah. yeah. I love this too, but not for $108. Oh, this is cute, but not as a dress. I love that blazer. Yes. Oh, I like that. That's rich. Absolutely. This is bomb. I'm getting this. We can put that sheep thing back. I love this. Oh my gosh, I can wear this on Thanksgiving. Right? That's cute. Yep. You want to put this back? No, no, no. Put that back. How cute these little red plaid vans are. You want these? Oh, Susu. That's my doy poo I love him. Oh, I love my baby. I love Abercrombie. Me, myself, and all my millions. Body like that. Body like that. These are cute. That would look cute on my bump. I like these holiday outfits. Oh, I love that. I want that. I want that. I want that. But this has gold buttons. I'm thinking more so sexy, like cleavage sexy top. This is large. That is cute. I like that. Oh, this is cute. I like, you guys don't like this? Hold on. You know? Like, what about like real short, like? You know what I'm saying? Hold on, hold on. Hold on, y'all. Give me a second. Let me fix it up. Hold on, y'all. Y'all don't like this? That's fitted. I'm telling y'all. I have style too. Don't play with me. Oh. Huh? I'm digging this. I'm digging this. What size is this? Mm hmm Do you have a, another... You work here? I do. Oh, a medium in this? I can check. Thank you. Because this has something on it. Oh, it's shorts. I didn't realize. Yeah, I, I didn't realize it was shorts. Yeah. No, this is gonna fit. I'm um, see. <laughs> hold on, wait, no, wait, hold on, wait, no. I like this. Get out of here, yo. <laughs> Zip me up, honey. Oh, is this medium? Okay, okay. What about this? You have medium? Yeah. What was your name? Dexter. Do you mind if I use this mirror as a change uh, fitting room? Fitting rooms, if you like. I don't want no fitting room. You don't want to use a fitting room. Yeah. I like the sparkle though. I kind of like this. It? So are we separating this? Space? We're gonna skip, separate it. Look. That's gonna be cute. Yeah, my stomach will show. Mm -hmm. This is mag. That is so cute. That's really? cute. Y'all, hello. Holiday. Ho hello, yes or no? I love it. What Which you top did you have on? Huh? The I had the medium on. Let's see. I feel so comfortable. Oh, yay! So what did I buy? What did I spend my money on this holiday? For myself and not anybody else? <laughs> Got comfortable. My attitude is in check. Clothes in check. I swear I bought more stuff. I think Shanae put the bags downstairs, but I want to show you guys these pieces because they're so cute. Look at my pillow. I bought this pillow from Home goods. Now y'all know I don't like patterns and colors and stuff, but the kids were like, mom, you're so boring. You need to like start 
doing colors for Christmas. Stop doing all those browns and whites and stuff. So I'm like, you know what, kid, you're right. So I added a pop of red and green. First of all, this blazer, it's a tan blazer. The material, it's so soft. It's tailored and it better be because this blazer was $168. I think I could wear this after pregnancy. We'll see. It's a size large. I cannot wait to style it. So I think I'm going to wear it with this crop top that I purchased from Express. This top was $44. And a lot of the time Express, they have sales. So I'm going to link the site in the description box below and all of the links to the products as well. I think I'm going to wear the crop top underneath the blazer. I see a lot of girls wearing like booty shorts with sheer tights. So I'm going to try that look with my big old bump. We will see. These are actually maternity shorts. <laughs> They're so cute. Baby mama shorts. And then I'm going to put these sheer tights underneath the shorts and then have my cheeks popping out and stuff you know what i'm saying a little sexy for the holidays you know don't make me dress like a granny just because i'm praying just because i'm older and stuff i need to be you know sexy show all y'all that i still got it i'm here to stay baby no i'm just joking well not really and then i got these pleather short shorts oh my gosh should i wear these ones instead i'm not sure but i'm gonna style the heck out of this blazer it's so bomb that's a showstopper right there right there and then i got black velvet blazer i just love the pads yes uh, i love this black blazer it's velvet and it just makes me feel like luxury um this one was 188 it looks like a conductor jacket i'm be conducting oh yeah y'all better get in line okay and follow my lead baby so with these blazers you know you can dress them up dress them down you know you can Oh my gosh, I'm seeing this with out a top underneath, you know, with some high-waisted black pants. That's it. Nothing underneath, baby. Just some cleavage and you're ready to go with like a little gold chain in there. Boss. I love this dress. Now, I was watching this girl. I think it's, her name is Carly Carly Bell Bible Bible anyways I'm obsessed with Carly and she did a video and shout out to Carly she just started her own makeup brand I'm so proud of her she's been in the game for so many years like over a decade I believe we started around the same time so I'm just like really so excited for her and I'm actually gonna buy some of her makeup products because back in the day she had a palette with a company that i used to bh cosmetics i think do you guys remember i think it was bh cosmetics oh my gosh it's so old school but she had a palette with them and i bought it and it was bomb so i know that her makeup brand is going to be everything because she's the type of person to i'm talking to talking about her like i know her but you know how it is like when you watch somebody for so long you feel like you know them you feel like so drawn to them connected to them and when you meet them in person it's like oh my god gosh, I've been like, we've been best friends in my head like forever. So I know a lot of you guys feel like that about me. And I also feel like that about, you know, a lot of influencers I follow as well. I stay invested in some of these people. Okay. <laughs> so I saw her wearing this like silky dress. I think it was a silky dress or a dress with um, a lace top underneath. And it was so freaking cute she's so beautiful so i was like oh my gosh i was in abercrombie and i saw this lace top and i was like let me pair it with a dress because i saw you know carly doing it oh my god like carly let me carly um she's a freaking mermaid i love her i don't have to wear it together i can actually what are you a nude bra underneath or no bra <laughs> Wear them separately. Like, you can even wear this to church. You know what I'm saying? Just put a turtleneck underneath and you're good to go, baby. A white turtleneck, cream turtleneck, and you're good to go. Go praise the Lord of this dress. You know, I'll bring in the New Year's in this dress at church. I'll leave a link to every single piece that I bought today in the description box below. So look out for that. And also, I post all of my fashion, all of my home decor, all of the things that I've been loving on my like to know it page. So be sure to follow me there. Even if you don't feel like shopping today, you might want to shop tomorrow or the next day. Okay, so follow me there ASAP because I post everything there. I'm always posting sales. I'm posting high end stuff, low end stuff, everything in between. Like it's going to be there. Pillows on there, my couch on there, my rug on there. What else is on there? Santa's on there. You know what I'm saying? You gotta 
dear on there, okay? And closure on there. So be sure to follow my like to know it page ASAP. It's free, so why not do it? Anyways, y'all, I'm so tired. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, I've been on edge. I had a very up and down day today. I'm happy, sad, crying, excited, attitude central. It's all over the place. Emotions are all over the place. I'm approaching my due date and so I'm excited about that. But when, you know, you're about to deliver and stuff. Anyways, I'm in my third trimester and I'm tired, okay? But we're almost at the finish line! We are doing this, baby. We are doing this together. And also, you guys, be sure to let me know in the comments below if we should do this live baby shower. Anyways, you guys, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Lord, have mercy. Oh, hold on. Should I put this on mute real quick? You gotta, I'll call you right back after I wrap up this video. I need to unwind. The kids are gone. I'm tired. I have to make two more calls and then we're good to go. Anyways, you guys, be sure to subscribe to the channel right and then after you subscribe hit the notification bell hit that bell because apparently youtube said that 70 percent of my subscribers don't have the bell turned on i'm like oh okay so i thought the support was real but i guess it's not real according to youtube so i'm just like if you support me you need to hit that bell asap i love y'all anyways let me call this person back i don't have i don't want to talk Ooh. I, like why do i need to talk i'm doing talking okay the kids are going i'm trying to relax you know what i'm saying bump is outside like i'm trying to go to bed but let me go ahead and uh call this person back hello hello